I've been working a graveyard shift and I ain't made shit. Wish I could grow me some big wings and fly. Big, black, beautiful wings, iridescent in the sunlight. I have dreamt of flying since I was a child. Catch myself some thermal rays. Rift along, shift along, fly along. Sometimes the earth is too much for me. The hate, the bigotry, the misogyny. But if I could spread myself wide, I would. Thick-breasted, thick-bellied and thick-thighed. Thick layers of feathers face to the giant orb. Launch myself off the nearest high rise. Rise high and fly, little black girl. Rise high and fly above the gum carpeted concrete. Cramped spaces filled with blunted souls above the dull, sad, colourless buildings and the stench of human misery. Bouncing off commuters, shoveling to jobs they hate, lovers they hate, journeys they hate, and lives they hate. Nothing but capitalist bait, sleepwalking towards a self-fulfilling fate. Each step weighs me down, gravity sits uncomfortably on my tired shoulders, sinking, resisting feet into unyielding ground, heavy, heavy with worry. Heavy with anxiety, heavy with stress, heavy with debt. Get up, go to work, make money, bleed money, make money, bleed money, make money, bleed money. Different days, same shit. Gas, rent, electricity, car tax, service, MOT, food bill, period bill, council tax. Nothing but a city rap. Hmm. Scurrying in the dirt, scurrying for scraps. Fake smile, fake laugh, fake happy. Don't want to get set back to the imaginary wall. Drowning to survive, no way to fry. So dream of pointing my face upwards, kissing the rays like a long lost love, releasing menelin, loosening stiffened limbs until they relax like well-handled dough for dumplings. Spreading my wings like a giant blanket, casting a shadow with itchy feet, nothing to keep me groundless, weightless and free. I've been working a graveyard shift and I ain't made shit. And I wish I could grow me some wings and fly. Big, black, beautiful wings, iridescent in the sunlight. You see, I've dreamt of flying since a child. Cats and thermals, rift along, shift along, fly strong. Sometimes the earth is too much for me. The depression, the isolation. Why didn't you just pick up the phone and call me? You sat alone for 11 days until your silence went on for just a little too long. But then it was too late. And you'd already been on a date with death. 20 years of friendship buried along with your red lipstick. The police officer said you looked peaceful. She said it looked like you were just sleeping, tucked up in bed, blanket up to your chin. The last time we met, I tried to convince you that you had so much to live for, that you were loved, that you'd be missed, that this feeling would pass and my words slip from my tongue immediately turning flaccid and useless and in the end we sat and you cried and we sat and you cried and we sat and you cried and I stroked your back and I held your hand and you claimed that you were tired of living this way that it hurt just to open your eyes and that you couldn't bear to face another day and I felt overwhelmed with despair thought that this could be the last time I saw you but the next day I brushed it off those feelings of dread Human optimism convinced me that you, my friend, would pull through. But this time there was no resurrection. And my guilt is real but selfish because this is not about what I did or what I did not do. This is all about you, your choice, your life to take, your fate to decide. I'll wait to have strong words with you, sis, when I see you on the other side. You see, I've been working the graveyard shift and I ain't made shit. And I wish I could grow me some big, black, beautiful wings, iridescent in the sunlight. You see, I've dreamt of flying since I was a child. Cats and thermal rays, rift along, shift along, fly strong. Sometimes the earth is too much for me. The hate, the bigotry, the misogyny. If I could flip the script, okay. So how many girlfriends have you had? How many girls have you slept with? What underpants were you wearing on the night of the said crime? Do you make a habit of molesting drunken girls? How much did you drink? What, you think it's okay to have sex with an unconscious body? Do you often sleep with drunk women? How did you come to the conclusion that she wanted sex? How would you feel if your mother or sister was raped? Have you ever had a consensual sexual relationship? How many sexual partners have you had? Do you think you've got a high sex drive? <laughs> I've been working a graveyard shift and I ain't made shit. And I wish I could grow me some big, black, beautiful wings and fly iridescent in the sun light. Sometimes the earth is too much for me. Black death by white hands meant to be an authority. Black death by white hands we are meant to call in moments of dire need. But when the cops arrive, all humanity will leave. 
there will be no stop button. The wheels would already have been set in motion. When the cops arrive, there will be no individuals, only a dark mass of features, a body to be controlled, a thick mouth to be silenced. When the cops arrive, there will be no black voices, no black cries. If it wasn't me or I can't breathe, when the cops arrive, they will close their eyes and bind their ears, and they will become a pack of frenzied wolves, unable to differentiate between truth and fallacy. And I wish I could swoop down fearsome and rage, rageful and pluck those brutalized black bodies from the jaws of death. Swoop in and rescue them, avenging angel style, before the final bell, before the white hands dressed in blue bend them into eternal silence. And decade after decade, as families are left with no justice and no peace. There is no protection on the streets, no money to hide behind. No Yeezy or his wife to plead your case. There is nothing but a legacy of 400 years of slavery based purely on greed. We are ordinary people. We do not walk bathed in a society and the safety that money and a move up the class system can bring because ordinary black bottles bodies are offered no shield. We cannot sing for our supper or rub shoulders of presidents or prime ministers willing to do us favors as long as we favor them. This body will always be problematic in a society that fails to recognize white privilege and superiority, fails to recognize it was built on the back of blacks. They stole a society that hides its history, history from slavery to the recent Windrush hypocrisy. Whoa. I've been working a graveyard shift and I ain't made shit. And I wish I could grow me some wings and fly. Some big, black, beautiful wings iridescent in the sunlight. Thank you.